Introduction Tissues Large numbers of specialized cells with similar function is called a tissue. Plant tissues There are three types of plant tissues Dermal, ground and vascular. Animal tissues Different types of animal tissues are Epithelial tissue, muscular tissues, connective tissue. Real-time example This experiment will help us to study about the plant tissues and its components like Parenchyma, Colenchyma, Sclerenchyma, Xylem, Ploem and the animal tissues and its components like Epithelial, Connective, Muscular and Nervous. Apparatus Record Permanent slides of parenchyma tissue, sclerenchyma tissue, striped muscle fiber, nerve cell and compound microscope. Place the permanent slides one by one. Observe its structure and draw diagrams. Observations First, plant tissue. Parenchymatous tissues. All cells are same in size and length. Corners of cells shows intercellular spaces. Each cell shows prominent nucleus and a large central vacuole. Each cell has thin cell walls. Intercellular spaces are present in between the cells. Sclerent chymatous tissues. These cells show thick corners and thick cell walls. They do not have any protoplasm in it. They show lignified walls. They can be divided into two types, sclerent chyma fibers and sclerites. These cells are dead. Colon chymatous tissues. The cells of chlorin chyma may be oval or elongated. Each cell consists of central nucleus with cytoplasm at the periphery. Cell walls are thickened at the corners. The thickening is due to cellulose and pectin. Intercellular space is absent. These cells are commonly seen below the epidermis in petal, leaf and stem. Its main function is to provide mechanical strength. Number 2. Animal tissue. Striated muscles. These muscles show long cylindrical fibers. The cells are multinucleated. The muscles show alternate dark and light bands. The cells are surrounded and held by connective tissue. non striated muscles are smooth muscles. The cells are spindle shaped. Nucleus is centrally located. These muscles do not show dark and light bands striation. non striated muscles are involuntary in nature. They are found in blood vessels and in alimentary canal. Cardiac muscles. Cardiac muscle cells are long, branched and uninucleate. They show alternate light and dark bands. These are involuntary muscles. They are seen only in the walls of heart. They are non-tiring muscles and responsible for rhythmic contraction and relaxation of heart muscles throughout life. Nerve cell. The nerve cell has a neuron with a large body called cyton. The cyton has a prominent nucleus. It has projections called dendrites. One of the dendrite which is long called axon. The nerve endings are attached to muscles.